Bringing on an experienced insurance agent when you in the market for insurance is imperative. Um, I mean, you could have an agent who is neatly dressed or whatever the case may be, but that don't make them experienced. Um, you think of small nuances like if a person applies for life insurance and they are under the age of 50 and have diabetes and high blood pressure. For most traditional life insurance policies or traditional life insurance companies, they'll be declined. Um, if a person has, let's say, multiple DWIs, for the most part, a traditional life insurance company is going to deny them. Um, or let's use something more simple. If a person takes Viagra for sexual enhancement um, and the agent just puts Viagra on the application, the insurance company will go out and order the person's medical records um, and may even want to perform um, paramed blood and urine on the customer simply because you never specify why they use Viagra. And outside of Viagra being used for uh, sexual enhancement, it's also used as a heart medicine. So the insurance company quite naturally is going to believe that it's for a person's heart, not for sexual enhancement. So when you're looking for an agent, just look for experience. Some of those things that can be written in the application so that a person is um, approved really comes down to your agent because once you are declined, your application goes through MIB, you know, the Medical Information Bureau, and every other insurance company that you apply for may decline you based on that first application that was declined that's sitting in the Medical Information Bureau.